All right, now in other news, the Ministry of Food and Agriculture has been engaging stakeholders on promoting greenhouse production. Here's more from a Fresh Green Ghana project conference in Accra. Private agribusinesses have organized the Fresh Green Ghana Project Knowledge Sharing Conference to deliberate on promoting safe greenhouse production in Ghana. Speaking at a conference in Accra, Acting Head of Horticulture Development Unit at the Ministry of Food and Agriculture, Esther Ajikum, revealed that the ministry has funded projects which did not yield expected results, hence the requirements laid out by the ministry to guide horticulturalists. Some recommendations from the Delphi report, it indicated the basic uh, design specifications with regards to the units, the construction, um, climate control mechanisms, and um, other things. For instance, that bothers on managing the, te the temperatures, relative humidity, the light intensity, the covering, the irrigation and fertigation systems, then the pest and disease control and the others. I think as has been brought forth here, our need for greenhouse production is very different from the temperate, uh, um, the very temperate regions. Sometimes sitting at the horticulture deck, sometimes I get frustrated and a bit saddened when people invest in the structures and it doesn't deliver. The conference was spearheaded by Agri Impact Consult in collaboration with Safisana and Urban Jungle, among others. CEO of Agri Impact Consult, Dan Akwe, shares the experience of his outfit in greenhouse production over the years. According to him, despite the challenges in the sector, the Ministry of Food and Agriculture is not to blame because the challenges are natural factors. The issue of humidity and temperature is still a major concern to greenhouse producers in Ghana. So we designed these projects to track temperature and humidity outside the greenhouse, inside the greenhouse, and producing transit. And there's more on that and other stories coming up on the marketplace at the top of the hour. Up next in sports, President of the Ghana Rugby Football Union, Herbert Mensa, has been suspended. Muftao Nabila will have the details right after this break.